Earlier today, I was at the Republican headquarters in Alpena, where many people were coming in getting last minute bumper stickers, decals and signage for their yards. The question for tonight is what does make America great again mean? I had an opportunity to speak with Republican headquarter chairman Jesse Osmer, who shared this. I would say a strong economy is definitely at the top of that list. Uh, the second thing is a strong military. And the third thing is just basically trying to get back to, to the roots of, of you know, where we were as a limited government. Osmer spoke about the handling of the COVID-19 pandemic and said the president should have given less control to the governors. I would have liked to have seen the governor work with our legislature uh, uh, early on. We didn't see that. Um, unfortunately, we had months of, of executive order after executive order up until the Supreme Court basically came out and said, you can't do this anymore, it's, it's illegal. When asked about race relations and the current divide in the country, Osmer had this to say. Often government reacts to, to how the people react. And I think that once we start having discussions, uh, once we basically uh, re-inject civility into our everyday lives, it'd be much better. Headquarters office manager Don Mantis, who was once a feminist and voted for former President Obama, says President Trump is a gift to this nation. I, after the past four years, what I've seen him do for this country, um, I danced to the bulls. Don's husband, Michael Mantis, says no matter the outcome, they are prepared to keep fighting. We're going to roll up our sleeves and, and keep getting back to work to continue to push our ideas uh, where we think they're needed. Social Security and Medicare was another topic discussed. Osmer assured that's a scare tactic used election after election. In Alpena, Stephanie Manici, WBKB News.